So with the back to school ads slowly killing our mental health, I thought today would be a good time to look back on primary school. Oh god, here we go. So first of all, I just want to say I don't I didn't really mind primary school. I mean, the only thing I had to worry about was that flippin' spelling test we had every Friday, but uh, other than that was okay. I just remember every Thursday night flipping studying 20 words I'm never gonna have to use again, but uh, what can you do? Thank you, autocorrect. Thank you. Or does anybody remember when teachers would talk to each other in Irish so that, you know, we didn't understand? I mean, it also felt like some flippin' cheesy gossip, but uh, I guess we'll never know who was having an affair on who. I mean, the only thing I came out of primary school knowing in Irish was flipping on will chiadigum dulgadi a letters. I mean, how would to say that every time I just wanted a piss was, you know, a little bit annoying? I mean, like, all I wanted was a piss, you know, no big deal. The only other thing I knew was a tea colour, which basically meant put your head down to give the teacher a freaking break. Or everywhere that we went in primary school, we had to line up. I mean, like, whenever we were going on the yard, we had to line up, flipping going into the class leaving the school like you know a bit hectic I mean we couldn't just wander into the classroom ourselves after break like we had to all gather up together and go in together I remember one kid got the tension for doing the Conor McGregor walk when he was coming in from break I mean the chap was only 10 like that's a bit lousy <laughs> Well, the only time that most people did that kind of walk was uh, when we got to ring the bell. I mean, whenever it was my turn to ring the bell, I'd flip and rejoice, like seriously. I mean, getting the responsibility to walk around the school with a flipping bell and just ring it all you want, you know, it was kind of special. Or in our school, uh, in the winter months, we weren't allowed on the grass because apparently it was wet and mucky. So then when spring came around and we were back allowed on the grass, we'd literally just run around flipping celebrating and flipping thanking the Lord, like seriously. Even a teacher videoed it. I mean, it was like this. Whoa! I remember getting the talk in sixth class. Oh lord, that was a little bit overwhelming. I mean, like, I didn't know anything previous to that, you know, I'll be very honest. And then, you know, going into a flipping class with some random woman explaining the magnificence of my own sausage. What was worse, so we had to, like, do worksheets on, like, women's, uh genital areas you know i'm gonna put it that way and you know uh i got them all correct because you know i'm a genius of that sort of thing uh i'm pretty sure that most schools had one of these you know when like junior infants or even senior infants when you had a flipping nature table i mean we had one of them for like two years and like literally everybody would just go out and yard and gather up a bunch of random twigs and just slap them down on the nature table i mean literally some random kid would go out and pick up some flipping bird shit and be like miss i found some bird poop can i put it on the nature table <sighs> oh lord or does anybody remember when everybody would like panic when they're trying to decide who they're gonna sit beside on a school tour? I mean, personally, I was fine, you know. I had my friend, you know, we'd sit together all the time. Lovely jubbly. But I remember the girls would be going around like, Oh my gosh, my friend, my BFF, uh, uh, L L Melissa, she's sitting beside someone else. Uh, 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 I, don't think she, uh, I don't think she likes me anymore. <laughs> Seriously, like there was just full on arguments, you know, great fun to watch. Flippin' saucy, like. Or you know that bellend who flippin' wouldn't share his colors? I mean, like, like me, I always shared my colors because, you know, I'm a sound man. But then there was always that flippin' bellend who just wouldn't give his colors to anybody and had all, the, all of them to himself. Like, you know, that's just a low of disrespect. Like, to not share your colors, like, what a flippin' dickhead. I remember uh, when somebody would like break their arm and everybody just had to sign the cast like I don't know why but uh, they did like I broke my arm once doing gymnastics oh fun times but no I remember when I came into school and like I brought in a marker and everybody was like just signing random shit in my arm like it was just a bit weird it's like at the end of sixth class when everybody signs your t-shirt I actually spill out mine I think 
Here we go, you know, this flipping beaut. Shout out to Shane for drawing the flipping tits on him, you know, thank you very much. But yeah, that basically sums up most of primary school, I think. But before I end the video, I just want to give a quick shout out to Alan Murray. Uh, he made my channel banner, so you know, you can go check that out. Link to his Twitter and YouTube channel will be in the description, so you know, go follow and subscribe to him. And as well, I want to give a quick shout out to Mikey Power, I think it is. His birthday was recently, so you know, happy birthday, Mikey. And watch on why I'm shouting him out. He actually noticed me at a Bonahan pitch. You know, I'm blushing. So anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you comment your opinions down in the comments below. And guys, don't forget to like, subscribe. And guys, I'll see you next time. Peace.